talking about the one David Bowie. And he's invited me here to check out his concert tonight. And where better than the only country where the sun never goes down, Iceland. Iceland is, is totally cool. It's a fantastic place. Iceland kicks fun. Oh man, it's like a secret. The scenery is fantastic. The, the clubs, the, the cafes, the people. It's everything about it is a dream. The only animals they got is a small wolf and a minx. And the food is incredible. I'd like to introduce <laughs> you to the Iceland tourist board. Yeah, absolutely. Meet Father Christmas. Oh my God! And I'm one of David the David says. Come to Iceland, it's <laughs> quite good. Now may change me. There's always a diamond friendly. This thing is going, it seems to be constantly evolving because from what I heard of the outside um, album and yeah. what I heard about the tour, yeah. is there's been a lot of changes going on. I mean you're yeah. playing a lot um, or at least you're intermingling a lot more of yeah. you know, the old. And I'm picking some strange pieces as well. I mean we're doing uh it's a song I wrote with Iggy Pop in the 70s, Lust for Life. Um, things like Aladdin Sane and from yeah. Tim Machine we're doing Baby Universal. So what I'm trying to do is, is put into the show the kinds of songs that actually fit comfortably with the kind of material that we're doing from outside. So it also means a lot of the stuff that I did with Brian Eno in the late 70s. So I've got mm. a lot of those in the show as well. David Bowie, this is my band. And thank you for coming. So this tour has been going on off and on since this August last year. So, you know, we've sort of been really, really touring hard. And the thing that's been happening an awful lot is that the audience has been just not my audience. I mean, it's just, I, I've just gotten a really different In, in what sound. way? In but, age? Yeah, it's incredible. Let's go! Method. There must be a method of, of getting new, younger generations. I don't know. I mean, it's the first time I've done this. I think all artists of my age are kind of working out who they are, what they want to play, and what they want to do in the future. I mean, there's a bunch of us that put it out fifties. And I think it's for us, it's as quite as sort of, you know, exciting as it is for It's a whole different thing. Do you think um, you're allergic to the mainstream then? Yeah, yeah, I don't think it's a tyranny. My intention always from the beginning was that I was going to be really stubborn and just go my own way. And if anybody was going to follow me, that was cool. And if they didn't, well, that was, you know, hard luck. But uh, I thought what I was doing was really interesting. And I thought, well, someone somewhere is going to like what I'm doing, you know. And I've gotten back into that. Oh, no, not me. I never lost control. Your fight to fight. With the man who sold the world. I read that you say, I, I'm a generalist. I take all forms of art. I said that in 1978, if I remember rightly. Fine. Yeah, I think I'm probably back to being a, a generalist. So, um. So just spot writing, you know, like. So does it mean to what end then? I'm doing something on your private life, actually. Oh, yeah, it's like a kind of a scoop thing, you know, for one of the tablets. God, it was Gwendolyn. I've been trying to keep her out of the public eye <laughs> for months now. Tragic. Crispin, Crispin and Gwendolyn. <laughs> Shut real, up! Now, now, that's story. enough. Oh, no one's in here, can you tell me that you're a man? You're on a double sleep wagon, they're inside the sea. Your band now is a kind of, um, completion of your circle music yeah, no, 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 no. tell me about the band uh, we're now a five piece we're down to Reeves Cabrels on guitar who is with Tim Machine 
Wonder. Guy Land Dorsey, who's been with me for this last year. Under pressure. <laughs> Zachary Orford is a young drummer um, from New York. Vision. Mike Garson on piano, who was used to be with me at the end of the Spiders. He was he, he joined us on piano. And the last time we worked together was 1974. Oh yeah. Some more?